So good afternoon. We're here with uh, Maritime Reporter TV. I'm Joe Keefe, the editor of Marine News and Maritime Logistics Professional Magazine. And I'm here this afternoon with Andre Corner. He's the Director of Industrial Technology, Head of Product Line and Commercial and Fast Craft at ZF. Good afternoon, sir. How are you doing today? Yeah, I'm fine. Great. Thank you very much. Are you having a good show so far? Uh, it's the first day, starting day, so it was uh, very interesting and uh, we're looking forward for the rest of the days. Okay, great. I made your press conference today and I saw you introduce the new transmission, the 83700. I want you to see if you could tell our readers a little bit about it, what it means, why it's special, and uh, uh, where you hope to position it, for what uh, vessels and that sort of thing. Yeah, we are introducing our new transmission, the 83700, here on the SMM. It's a brand new designed uh, transmission. It's uh, intended for uh, fast uh, ferries, for example, for offshore petrol vessels, crew transfer, uh, transfer vessels. It's coming for, with a maximum input power of 11,500 kilowatts. It's uh, having a ratio up to 5.4. It's uh, robust designed. It's uh, it offers um, the best power to weight and power to dimension ratio you will find on the market. So, especially on the fast vessels where you have weight constraints and dimension constraints, it's a perfect fit for this type of vessels. It comes with uh, various options: PTIs, PTOs with turning devices, locking devices. So what is requested today from the market, we can offer in a modular design and uh, yeah, built according to the well-known ZF standard, stands for reliable and uh, low maintenance cost transmissions. Terrific. Um, so the other thing that you talked about today at the press conference was uh, condition monitoring and uh, your version of it. Uh, big data is a big deal right now. Everybody's talking about it. Uh, remote monitoring, the whole nine yards. But, but what does conditioning monitoring mean to you at ZF and what is it going to mean for your clients? Yes, it, you're right. Uh, if, you go, uh, if you go over the uh, exhibition here, SM, SMM, you see a lot of... Uh, uh, industry 4.0, a lot of about big data, about commission, uh, condition-based monitoring systems. Yes, and we also uh, have uh, a concept available for condition monitoring systems. Um, what it is offering to our uh, to our customers is uh, simply that you do the right service at the right time. That's that's the goal. Um, we are monitoring the status of the uh, tr uh, transmissions. We have some advanced uh, sensors available uh, where we can measure uh, vibrations, uh, dynamic loads. And out of this data, we can exactly tell our clients when it is necessary to do a service and which service is necessary. This, at the end, will uh, reduce maintenance costs and it will ensure the availability, which is the main, uh, main focus. So if you get an information and the system is telling you you should do a service in the next 400 hours, it will be a perfect information. They will do the service, they will look into and prevent a failing of the transmission and therefore a failing of the whole boat. So the, uh, but the, the, the condition monitoring, not only will it uh, uh, tell you when the maintenance is due in terms of time, but uh, will this be able to uh, predict a failure that's uh, imminent if there is a piece of machinery that's not uh, functioning correctly? It will, uh, we will see the condition of the, of the whole transmissions. We will see the conditions of the bearings, we will see the conditions of the, uh, of the oil, we see the conditions of the, of the clutch. And out of these conditions, we can really give uh, information to our uh, to the to the operator what he should do to prevent that this fails. Does it will prevent any failure on the transmissions? I don't believe so. I am realistic enough. There will be sudden events happening that that can fail uh, a system. It will not prevent it. But I'm uh, absolutely convinced that this will give. Uh, the operator a much better 
a prediction on what is going on on his transmission. So he will be in the position to plan to uh, <coughs> to steer the service work on his vessel in a way that it's best fit into his schedule, that it best fit um, into its operation profile and therefore uh, really help him uh, to maintain the vessel and, and to keep it operational. Terrific. So there's a lot going on at ZF. Um, in new transmission, new product and uh, a new service in the condition monitoring. Um, uh, we look forward to uh, seeing it in action and uh, we thank you for coming by today. I know you're busy at the show. I thank you very much. It was very interesting. Yeah, and we will have a good show, I'm sure. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you.